Still you can't be fed up Go girls with the left and the right Go green like the what is going on guys, Son of Beast here. We are back with another NBA Playoffs as the Dallas Mavericks take on against the Utah Jazz. Right at that moment of my screen, uh, as I'm just saying, I'm just trying to make it best and make sure it looks good. Don't want any buffers or, or, or any save changes at that moment. But that time, I'm going to make a uh, statement for, for this game. It's it's not that complicated, but uh, but it's very it's really easy to uh, make sure if I get this one right in time. In the meantime, we're heading back to Vivint Smart Home Arena. Arena. So if you guys are taking a look at taking a look at Scott Cole winning tips at Dynam and Dynamic Duos, make sure you do this one. What are your favorite duos in the NBA history? Post a comment down below in any history. Could be the present year. Mine is Kobe and Shaq. I really like him how they play, but they work really well. That's all I give you care. It's just a, it's just your thoughts. Which players you like? But anyway, there's a lot more that needs to be done. So let's get the game at Utah ready to go. And this is going to be a second game as the Dallas Mavericks enter their way through in Utah. And here is this game. It is brought to you by Express. This lighting is coming out. A fantastic night showing you around here that much. The Dallas Mavericks and the Jazz. So right now, game two is still on its way. And we are ready to see which game could be the game winner of game two. DA, do I have any updates? Well, the writing was on the wall for the end of the grit and grind era in Memphis. Mike Conley, the Grizzlies' all-time leader in points, assists, three-pointers, and games played, knew it was time for him to part ways with the organization. And joining Utah, Conley is on a team with a chance to once again compete deep into the playoffs. And Kevin, he's a significant upgrade for the Jazz. A lot of Utah Jazz are still making happy with a lot of changes, but there are going to be more, more plays that is happening through this season. Here are the Western Conference standings as Dallas wins 40, wins 40, uh, has 40 wins, and Utah wins 42. Takes a win, 42 wins. It's just easy enough that needs to get on here that time. It, it's got to be easy to find out what is happening here. For your key matchup, it will be it will be Donovan Mitchell against Seth Curry, and then Luka Doncic against uh, Mike Conley in a point guard matchup. We're all ready to get going here. Let's see who wins the tip off. And for the Jazz. And the Utah Jazz wins the tip off, and we are ready to go. Let's get started. Conley outside is covered by Donkic. And then it's Dwight Powell against Rudy Gobert. Then it's O'Neal against Hardaway Jr. Seth Curry against uh, Donovan Mitchell. And Porzingis against McDonovich. There's a personal foul called on Seth Curry. His first. much prefer. Kevin, First personal foul was being off on necessary. Make it a lot clearer. Mitchell covered by Curry. Passes off to Gobert. And here are some commentators: it's Clark Kellogg, Dick, Greg Anthony, and Kevin Harlan. Takes a three. The wide open look for a three for Donovan Mitchell is no good. Mavericks in possession. Curry, the Curry finds Powell. Back to Curry. Back to Curry. Shoots over McDonovich. And it's rebounded by Brzingis. What a save here by D.Y. Powell. What a nice uh, save. Over Conley. Over Conley. The first shot for Donkic is good. Donkic. Just under six minutes to start. Conley the pass to Bogdanovich. The near drive for Bogdanovich is good. Assist by Conley. So for Dallas, their last game, the loss to Denver. Their last game, they played against Denver right back in regular season. But their game might be a lot be hard 
for each each team after they face against uh, the regular season against Denver. It's hard to uh, beat them out of here, but at this point, Western Conference is no joke at all. Gobert double teamed. After the shooting, after the shot for Hardaway Jr., Porzingis with the trying for a triple to tie it up, but no good. Outside Curry. Outside is Curry. B Powell back around. Donkic on the cover by Mitchell. Mitchell against Donchich. Over Mitchell. 15 footer for the shot, no good. Boy, he's got to be disappointed in the result. O'Neal. Defender, it's covered by Hardaway Jr. with a nice defender. Two for four for the field goals. Hardaway Jr. outside, covered by O'Neal. Oh, almost went up a crossover. But now back to Hardaway Jr. Goes up. Rebound by Mitchell. After a miss for Hardaway Jr. It's a three-point game. And we got a block for uh, Z.Y. Powell, and the recover was Mike Conley. At time in his jump to block the shots. Dallas lead by one. Luka Doncic passes to Curry. Now pass to Luka Doncic. A drive, and it's a basket for four points for Doncic. You know, as I watch Doncic, I think it's futile to try to distract this guy. His focus and concentration and control of himself is um, excellent. His excellent skills are putting up the prize, doing really well. Here's Bogdanovich outside, rolling in, passes up to the heart of O'Neal. So right now, uh, Dallas has one to zero. Three seconds with the shot. McDonavich with a second point shot opportunity. She's got a second bucket of the night. And you know That's four points for McDonavich. Shooter from there. Here's Donkic. Has to do a better job against him in that situation. Pass to Porzingis. And he's fouled through. And here's a foul on McDonavich. His first personal foul. Porzingis will go to the line to shoot two free throws. He's always two steps ahead with his mental game. You know, Kevin, that's a great, great point. Feel, savvy, experience, know-how. You know, he grew up playing against bigger, stronger guys, and that always serves you well as you go forward. So he understands how to create space and anticipate and feel how to get defenders off balance. I mean, he's just a special, special young player. Porzingis hits the first free throw. Porzingis plays with such fearlessness. I love that. These substitutions are coming in. All four players, uh, all three, play three players have that. Three players have in. Porzingis moves to the center position. Royce O'Neal is checked out, and Joel Joe Ingles is checked in. He's checked in for Dwight Powell. Dorian Finney-Smith comes in for Hardaway, and it's right in for Seth Curry. And both free throws. Both free throws for Porzingis is good. And that's his and first basket of the night. With the longest active Jazz trailing by three. Pro basketball team. Conley passes to Mitchell. Because they actually give a Mitchell turning out to go for a drive. There's a two for Mitchell. And once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself. Not a surprise look, but there's a lot more to get things done. Maxi Kleba, only the first person back on the court. Here's Cleaver. First person that comes on the court. Fouls going on. Rudy Gobert is, is first. Maxi Kleba only has 12 points, three assists, and he missed four shots for uh, after a loss against uh, Denver Nuggets back in the regular season. Yeah, and I like that philosophy, guys. I'll tell you what. There's a lot of things that's about to be happening for. Um, for Maxi Kleba, he wasn't able to uh, to return the game at that moment. It's really kind of hard. I don't have any suggestions to say. I mean, that's all I have to say. Porzingis hits the first free throw. Brunson just comes in for Luka Doncic. Brunson comes in for Donovan Mitchell, and it's Moutier in for Mike Conley. And, and is also making a switch. And Ed Davis comes in by Bogdanovich, and two players, Clarkson and Moutier, checked in for. Uh, for Conley and Mitchell. So both free throws for Porzingis is good. Clark, I'm gonna get a little deep. Under three minutes left. Here's Clarkson. 
the only guy that has ever been played since uh, he played with the Cleveland Cavs. But his second career might be going for is the Utah Jazz. Because, because uh, Ricky Rubio was, seems to be missing. What kind of fancy is that? Porzingis? That was weird. I just did not see that how it was coming in. Joe, Joe Ingles missed the three. Not the better one we were looking for, but this one might be a little bit too much focus. Right back to Kleba. Kleba passes to Finney Smith. He is a shot for Brunson. Dallas, no good. Brunson, no good. Clarkson with a drive. It's now a two point. Two point shot for Clarkson. Somebody on defense. Under two minutes left. Field goals 38% for Dallas and 45 for Jazz. Here's a drive. And that's going to be his first basket of the night for Wright. DeLon Wright. Moutier against Brunson. Finding his way, looking for some open shots. Moutier back up to the other way. Gobert against Porzingis. He passes up, rolling over to Moutier. Three seconds to go with the shot. Moutier's first shot, no good. Right, the pass to Kleba. Dallas leading by three. Clemson kicks to Finney Smith. Finney Smith rolling over to D White, Dion, Dion Wright. Clarkson against Wright. The drive, the right. As second basket of the night, and that is four points. Nice play call for uh, Maxi Kleber to help him out. I love the I love the offensive work. They're putting up a lot more help, help here, and they're doing really well. Trailing by five. Clarkson with just two points. Now he needs to get another one. Block the pass by Wright, and here he goes. Clarkson has his first personal foul. That'll be their third team foul for Utah Jazz. Fifth and six free throws for uh, the Mavericks. And now Wright will shoot for two since he never got a chance to make it that deeper enough for the layup. Elon Wright didn't hit the first free throw. Here are some new changes as Berea and Carly Stein comes in for Brunson and Porzingis. One shot for Wright after a first miss. After the first miss. Miss. Should say that one, right? Not the miss. Delon Wright off target here, unable to con unable to shoot two free throws. And a rejection by Finney Smith. I wouldn't read too much into it. There's still a lot of game left. Cleva passes to Wright. Cleva back again by Wright. Bounce passes to Finney Smith. Pass to Carly Stein. His first shot's good. Rises up, he knows he's probably going to get a clean look. It's a matter of executing. You know, for me, it doesn't get any better. 15 seconds left for uh, for the first quarter. Clarkson rolling around and finds a shot. Inside, Clarkson shows good body control. Seven seconds left. Passing to Kleba with a buzz beater. And the last second for the uh, buzz meter is no good as the end of the first quarter has appeared. 17 to 12. Looking better at that time, but the early start was coming really soon for Dallas. We'll be right back. Starting out for the second quarter, here's Perea. And we have approached here as Mike Conley had his way his journey on his expectation that he was going to bring out something of big happening tonight. And for those of you just tuning in, but I might be really wrong because of, uh, one of each uh, one of each player might be on their way to their journey to a, the NBA star. There might be a, there might be a, they might need to work on it a lot more to keep it to keep it running. But for those that, for those of you who are uh, who are playing basketball, keep playing hard. We want to make sure you're feeling good and make sure we don't want you any health incurring. 
health insurance, make sure you have your medical bill. Make sure, we want to make sure you all do. After the shot for right, Coley Stein has his first personal foul. Shooting two will be Emmanuel Moutier. Yeah, they're showing some muscle also in the first half. Here's some breakdowns for the Mavericks. Eight and eight. They range in points and paint. They show. A free throw good for Moutier as his first shot went in. Here are news changes. Right and Finney Smith are checked out. Curry and Hardaway Jr. are checked back in. You see on the floor, good and bad. Ingles, Davis, Gobert are checked out. Davis, Ingles, and O'Neal. And while well, uh, Ingles and Davis are switching up from point forward to the center. Second shot for Moody ain't no good. Curry almost lost it. Almost stepped out of bounds, but we covered it. Cleabud over to Hardaway Jr. Hardaway Jr.'s shot went missing. I love guys going after rebounds on the offense. Six fifteen left. Here's the shot for Clarkson. Clarkson. Clarkson with the fadeaway jab pass. And there he is again. Six points, one rebound, and only two misses already. Two missed shots, but only three went in. Here's Carly Stein. Carly Stein rolling around. Here's a shot. Harley Stein went missing off wide. Clarkson for three. The shot by Clarkson for three is no good. Mavericks lead by four. Carly Stein passes to Hardaway Jr. Pass to Curry with a shot. So that's two points for Curry and guys, first basket of the night, assist by Hardaway Jr. Carson coming in and there's the block by Kleba. Let's go over to DA. Kevin, coming into the 2017 draft, Donovan Mitchell wasn't sure he was ready for the NBA. Mitchell said, I worked out in the summer with Paul George and Chris Paul. They were the ones who convinced me to keep my name in the draft. They said, look, you're good enough. Just go out there and show it. Kevin, through a couple of seasons in Utah, that's exactly what Mitchell has done. He has made, he has made his un 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 unstoppable run. It looks like Mitchell's already ready. After the, uh, after the shot for uh, Tim Hardaway Jr. for three, assist by, what do you call that, Kleba. The Jazz will call their first timeout. Just 4.48 left. Looking something familiar for the Jazz to, to come in. Everything's going out or really going forward and backwards. You know that's true. And now here's the Jazz as uh, Ed Davis is looking for looking for one of each uh, one of uh, one of the great players, Donovan Mitchell. Reach and foul will go on Luka Doncic. Luka Doncic is subbed in by JJ Barea. McDonovich, Mitchell, and Conley are subbed back in. Here's Mitchell outside in the corner. Only had 11, 11 points after the loss against. Uh, against OKC uh, in playoff session by game five. Davis with the save. Awesome rebound and that's his first basket of the night. They looking really well here. What a shot for Rod Ed Davis is putting up the dunks. Just like Rudy Gobert did. I don't think it would be a bad idea, Kevin. I mean, might not be a bad idea, but I don't think it might not be anyway. Powell rolling over to Donkic. Dallas needs to get off Powell for three. And there we have a loose ball foul on Willie Carly Stein, his second. And that turns it over into an offensive foul. So that's a, so that's a first turnover for a Dallas Mavericks. And now Conley is going back, back in to find somebody who's looking for an open spot to go in. Conley with the floater, no good. Powell passing it up to Hardaway Jr. That's six points for Hardaway Jr. since he's looking for something, something big. Donkic rolling over to O'Neal. Offline. Mitchell with the rebound. 
Rebound. Here's Mitchell. Mitchell with the two. And Curry pulls And Curry takes their first Mitchell rebound. With the ball, bringing it up for the Mavericks. With only five Back points. to Luka Doncic. 3.20 left to go. Davis against Doncic. Finds Curry. 13. 13 footer. Curry can't get, Curry it, can't get it that time as Powell was trying to get, to get the rebound. The field since the second quarter got Bogdanovich. Passes it to Davis. Passes it, it, it up to Mitchell, covered by Donkic. Back to Davis. Back to Davis. Fives to shoot. The Jazz need to get with the shot for O'Neal. And a shot clock won't be counting as the shot. It went off wide. Powell passes to Donkic. 2.40 left. Curry looking it over. Screen on Powell. The drive, and there's a two-pointer for Curry. That's four points for uh, Seth Curry, as Stephen Curry's watching his brother playing on the court and see how he's doing since uh, the Golden State Warriors are not in the playoffs. Fortunately, they were having a worse day so far without, play, without the help from uh, KD. Uh, KD. The Mavericks have gone Andre Udala and, and, and other players. Zero points in the last 226 uh, two, two per minute. Two minutes left. Powell up. That's rebounded by Donkic. As shots good. Donkic has got six points. And that's the 11 point Dallas lead. Maybe there's a lot of questions about how Donkic did play him after he was ready to take on the NBA history since he came all the way down from EuroLeague. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking about. Is EuroLeague went amazing. Donkic was the only person that just ready to take it up the uh, ready to take the uh, NBA NBA uh, history of the game, his season, and he's and he's all. And, and, he, and he knows how he could do this and do it what he could do. Carly Stein shot no good. Since he came from the Euro League, he knows everything. And there's Mitchell with the shot. Assisted by Bogdanovich. Timeout Dallas with 101 left. 28 to 19. Almost there. Almost done with the first half, but there might be a lot more changing ability that they need to uh, get back through. Anyways, I'm subbing out Hardaway Jr. and Curry, and then and and Carly Stein. Yes. Yeah. So uh, so Luka Doncic will go right from the uh, shooting guard, and I'm subbing back uh, Brunson in, and then uh, and then Powell. I don't know where uh, where the heck is Powell at, but that might that might be a confusing part. Um, Porzingis, and then uh, and then Powell back at the center. So let's. I'll, I'm going to fix the offense uh, look. Let's see. Yeah, there might be a better chance here. I, I'm thinking this might be the right one. Jazz with some changes here, and uh, after that, we're down to one minute. Dallas also making some changes. Donkic past the Powell. Right over with Donkic, and what a dog for Powell. Jalen Brunson in for Curry. Tell you what, for a young player, Donkic has already shown tremendous skill and feel for the game. Beautiful floor awareness there. So it's the Jazz now. So it's the Jazz on possession. Clarkson only got six points. Gobert passing it back to Clarkson. The drive, and Donkic was off the line trying to make a heavy contestant, but Clarkson has got eight. Donkic outside of the wing. Pass to Brunson. Screen on Porzingis. His shot. Oh, what a dunk by Porzingis. Yeah, he's known for his finesse game, guys, but Porzingis. The finesse guy. guy. <laughs> he's got some power to his game, too. His power ability for Porzingis, it is. I think he's I think he's I think he's here with the Dallas after he played uh, after his last season against the Knicks. 
in, two, in 2019 season. His his next possession is he wants to give it. A, he, he wants to help out the uh, Dallas Mavericks, and he has another job to take. Oh, the block by Powell and the shot clock violations on on Jazz as it will turn things over into Dallas ball. We haven't seen any block shot before a shot clock violation was uh, uh, expired. And so, 32-21 is your score in the first half. We have closed it off already. And the second half will be uh, on its way back after this. Now let's send you over to David Aldrich on the sideline. Take it away, DA. Kevin, thanks. Here with head coach Quinn Snyder. Coach, what adjustments are you going to do in the second half? You just got to keep playing, keep taking the shots. And that's not the issue as much as us uh, not executing on offense. When we don't score, sometimes our defense lags as well. Everybody wants to see the ball go in the basket first, right? Thanks, coach. Back to you, Kevin. Thanks, David. Second half is underway next. After the halftime show, we'll see how it comes out. Don't go anywhere, T. NBA playoffs will continue after this. We are all set here in the second half as this game is coming to an extent by Dallas. 32 to 21 is your score. A lot of projecting lead at that time. A lot of things are happening to make a change here. Luka Doncic with just only six points. He might have to help his team if they can if they can get back into it into it where they belong. Donkic lost a shot. That was a, that was a solid D on Rudy Gobert. Bogdanovich with the shot. The fouls go right on Porzingis. His first. Any player in particular, one player that you looked at on the floor and you were out there as well saying, oh my There's a lot of it going on here. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. A lot of uh, crazy uh, highlights uh, that you guys should know about each player. There's a lot of them that we're going to uh, keep it out. One of each of the players that we can, uh, su that we can all uh, support. But we're going to need to know uh, which player could do best. And yes, Alex Ratner is, uh, is about to be trying... Uh, He's about to be trying out the uh, boys' college basketball after his graduation, he, and he has attended at Ohio State University. Yes, of course, uh, Ohio State University. Also, I'm looking for uh, my my my, uh, my football my better, best football player, uh, Stephen Cassidy. He's playing football, college football, at uh, Rhode Island. Am I, oh no, Delaware. I don't, I don't think it might not be that. Uh, I, I might have to figure it out right now. Luka Doncic passed to Powell. Powell shot went off wide, missing. Mitchell coming in. That shot goes in for Mitchell. Great move for uh, Donovan Mitchell to get off in the second second half, but he needs to get get back out here to uh, to show how it goes. Curry passes up to uh, Hardaway Jr. Pull over to Doncic. Shot for uh, Doncic is off. Recovered by Powell. Now for Zingas. Over for Bogdanovich, the shot for Przingis is good. Assist from Hardaway Jr. Eight points for uh, Przingis. I don't know if I say it right. Conley against Doncic. Outside is Bogdanovich. Inside, Rudy Gobert, and we finally got a first point at the night. Rudy Gobert's got two. Assist by Bogdanovich. Dallas lean by seven. Powell gain away. Oh, what a block by Rudy Gobert. That's send it right in the other way. That'll be his first block of the night. Mavericks with the ball. That's eight rebounds for Rob Powell and eight points for Kristaps uh, Porzingis. Feeling it out of it. Pass up to Doncic. Over Mitchell. And misses, it off misses off the line, off the rim, and didn't shoot well enough. Reacher foul's going on Seth, Seth Curry, his second. 
That's foul number two for him. Here are some new changes for uh, Dallas Mavericks. Berea, right, and Kleba are checked in. And Berea subbed in for Luka Doncic. O'Neal finds Conley. Conley against Berea. Conley against Berea. Oh, the screen went late for Gobert. It's tipped. It's tipped by Wright. Not quite two and a half. Not quite well enough to find a pass, but there's a turnover. Berea against Mitchell. Berea against Mitchell. Outside pass is outside. It's Conley. Rudy Gobert against Porzingis. Now here's Gobert. Defense is right there. Pass to Mitchell. Mitchell with it. Oh, yeah, off of the way. Porzingis with the block. What a what a nice block from Porzingis! Oh, whoa! I gotta go with that one and play that one again. What a great dunk by Hardaway Jr. He runs along, and he is showing no mercy on the on the ruling court. You know that, right? Gobert outside, only got two points. Donovan Mitchell looking around a bit. Covered by Wright. Conley for outside. Rebounded by Gobert. The shot counts for Gobert. Sleep out with his first personal foul. Four points for Gobert. And go to the line to shoot one. You've got to work harder on the glass. And you look back at that 2013 draft, just call it the year of the sleeper Euros. Giannis Antetokounmpo taken 15th, and this guy, Rudy Gobert, selected with the 27th pick. And Utah making Yes, 27th pick for uh, Rudy Gobert, and that's his number 27 for Rudy Gobert since 2013 with Giannis. Might be maybe because of Rudy Gobert might be the same uh, might be almost the same thing just like Hanji Kumpo used to be except the uh, guarding position. But I'm just not gonna know if, if it's if it's fine enough to uh, get back on the uh, on the other hand. Kumpo passes to Berea after a missed shot from uh, Gobert. Gobert's shot. Gobert's solid D puts him up the point. Ingles missing the in the in the paint by by a free throw line. Dallas leading by seven. Three fifteen left. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. Nothing on the scoreboard for Berea. Berea gets to right. Right outside. Kleba bounce pass to Porzingis over Ingles. A shot's good for Porzingis, and that's ten. Mavericks lead by nine. Porzingis having a lot of a uh, having a lot of good uh, strategy on the court. Looking really well. Much more individual play. Under three minutes. Here's Conley. Following the basket by Kristaps Porzingis. Passes up to Rudy Gobert. Rolls it over to Donovan Mitchell. Here's Mitchell. Here's Mitchell. Tries again. Tries again. Six points for Gobert. That's his third basket. New changes will be uh, coming up on its way after the next set falls on. Mitchell, Conley, the drive for Conley's good. That's five point Dallas lead. Assist by Donovan Mitchell. Yep, exactly. And if there's any other way, you got to push it and push it every time. Oh, almost made it in, but the foul's on Rudy Gobert, his first. Last, last 10 games, it was 77% with uh, with the field goal, uh, field goal percentage. Maybe it might be his top 15 all, all of a sudden with the best players, top NBA top 15 for the best NBA players that had a lot of uh, focus. Maybe there's a lot more to get to get back in. First shot for Wright's good. Here's a different look for Utah. And Dallas. Porzingis and Berea. Checked out. Cauley Stein and Brunson are checked in as Porzingis switches off to point forward. Moody and Clarkson is checked in for Conley and Mitchell. Wright gets two free throws. And that will be eight points for DeLon Wright. Jazz trailing by seven. 
Oh, Moutier lost the ball, but Brunson recovered. And that will be the same thing, just like Gobert had. Emmanuel Moutier with his first personal foul. Brunson will go to the line to shoot two. We've seen them make the extra effort from a defensive standpoint closing out airspace and sending shots back. It worked hard tonight at crashing the boards as well. It had a bunch of second chance points. Here's Brunson's shot, just the first one. And then the second one. Brunson hits first free throw. Well, the number 33 pick. This is the 31st pick. Team Dream. Jalen um, off to a pretty good start. And what year? What, I this forgot. This guy is so solid. That's his 31st pick. The Naismith Player of the Year and a two-time champion. Let me ask Siri. Nova. No surprise to see him. When did Jalen Brunson first draft? He's all business. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. Impeccable from the line this halftime. No misses yet. Oh, this was recently uh, back in 2018. I think Brunson was uh, was seeing things coming out here after the second round draft pick. Curry third in the first round, third pick in the second round. I think that's why Brunson was looking out here so far. I'm looking for one of these players that did draft in a long time before uh, it comes back in. Moutier! With second personal foul, and it looks like Brunson will go back to the line to shoot it again. Here in the last three days, as Robinson takes the lead with 77.3, Rudy Gobert in second place. He has been on fire. He might be on fire, but he has to stay focused, ability to find which player he can guard, he can guard on. Brunson with the second round draft pick in 2018. But his shot was just got lucky right now as he started his rookie year. And then, it was, and then in 2019, it was Joe Morant with Zion Williamson with the, their first with their first round pick. Brunson hits two free throws. One forty-three left to go. Clarkson dishes it off to Ingles. Now the pass to Clarkson. Passes to Clarkson. To the right side. To the right side is Moutier. Passing it back to Ingles. Pocket six. The shot. Ingles has got his first basket. And has his first bucket for two points. They are on their heels every time the ball comes inside. So it's nice that uh, Ingles got his first basket, but, he, but he's not done yet. He has to figure something out to, to, go, to know which which uh, which side is he does he need to go to. That's just too easy of a shot to miss. Pass to Moutier. Moutier's shot went, went off target, went unlucky. Porzingis passes to Brunson. Brunson with only four points. Now he passes to Wright. Six on his shot clock. And Wright's shots is good. That's ten points for Wright. Consistency in terms of tough consistency for each for each player is trying to give him an open uh, a hard contested shot. Now it's Utah Clarkson against Wright. Under twenty seconds left. Nice see for Brunson after a miss comes up by Clarkson. Porzingis. Oh. What a try this is! How does Porzingis know where where he he has an open spot? Well, he's he's wide open enough. Just wanted to give him another one. Buzz beater won't count. That's the end of a third quarter. Forty-eight to thirty-seven is your score. Dallas Mavericks looking its way to Game Three. The Jazz are still having a hard time to get back in. They need more of our time to to uh, show what game this is. We'll be right back after this. State Let's take a look at the State Forum assist of the game. Just true artistry. Right? One of his artistry part of his player was all I need to know was Luka Doncic, a first person drafted in uh, 2000. 
2014. I think it's 2016 or 15. There might not be any choices, but I'm going to have to find out what uh, Luka Doncic got drafted. Let's see. From these teams to when did Luka Doncic first four. got drafted in NBA? Conley out there with Jordan Clarkson, and it's O'Neal. It's the small forward. That's the final yeah, four for the Jams. Oh, Rudy Gobert made the dunk. Assist by Conley. And yes, Rudy Gobert is back in the second half, but his first half went too cold. Oh, here's Donkic trying to make his fourth shot. Yes! Donkic got it in to go. He's got the lead up to 11 right now. On the other hand, it's Clarkson. 6.20 left in the fourth quarter. Gobert with the screen. Outside is Conley. So that's a, a nice dunk move here for Brzingis I really do mention. Ingles in the shot. His second bucket is no good. That's six rebounds for Brzingis. And Curry with on the ball trying to make it easier. It's Powell with the layup assist by Curry. That's one of the many areas that they've had the advantage in. As a result, they've got a big lead. Jazz trail by now Jazz trailing by struggling here on offense. Yeah, trailing by 23. Conley, Conley shot on no miss. Powell's got nine. That's rebounds nine rebounds for Powell. Just under five thirty left. Doncic outside. Covered by Ingles. That's to Persingas. L plan saying defense. There's a takeaway by Rudy Gobert. Here's the fast break. Oh, Clarkson delivers a slam dunking to to relax and stop getting hyped up. What a shot this is! An assist after the fumble, stealing by Rudy Gobert. Dallas calling timeout. What amazing! How amazing does Clarkson need to know? He looks. He's fantastic. Maybe Donovan Mitchell will never know about it. <laughs> We've been freaked out about Clarkson, about staying with his team. So, Luka Doncic was the first uh, person, was the third pick of the, uh, Luka Doncic has his third pick uh, in 2018 at, um, in first round in the third pick. Right now, here's a look for Dave D.A. His team was well ahead. He said, this is the time to turn up the heat. Make one final push and try to close out strong. Let's see if they were listening, guys. Jazz trailing by Jazz trailing by 11. The finish for Doncic is good. Forget about going. Forget about him. He's definitely ready to go. He's not. He's not. Re he's not ready. He's all ready to go. Brilliant throwdown. Brilliant throwdown for Mitchell. Here's Doncic. The shot. shot's off for Doncic without, without the fake, and then went off wide. O'Neal against Hardaway Jr. This was his first pick, just like Jalen Brunson played. O'Neal with another shot. They are swacking up to seven. Trailing by seven, and that's Luka Doncic after uh, he played with the Atlanta Hawks, but he decided not to. Because he wants to help him out uh, before Dirk Nowitzki retired. Shot for Donkic is off. And that is a textbook example. A lot of uh, hard contest shots on each player. So they're like they're like hard to get through. Conley with a shot. Six that time. Six points for Conley, and he's back in the target. The adjustments they've made offensively. Third pick for uh, Luka Doncic uh, with the Atlanta Hawks, but he didn't seem to really care as he didn't want to bring it back in. So he decided to give it a go with uh, Dallas Mavericks. We got a steal by Ingles as Powell lost the ball. Yep, the floater right here for Conley's good. Assist by Royce O'Neal. Free 10 left. Mitchell, passing to Kleba. Curry passing to Powell. 
Over Gobert, the shot by, by Powell's no good. I like what they're doing here, but they're not giving it up yet. Oh, O'Neal missed the three, didn't connect it up to make it tied by one, to trail by one. The Kleba's drive is off, the foul's on Royce O'Neal, while Rudy Gobert was on the, on the floor. But Kleba's drive was off his, uh, was out of his way. Maxi Kleba will go to the line to shoot two. After the fouls on Royce O'Neal, he never got an attention foul for uh, for Royce O'Neal. Stop the stop the clock at two thirty-eight remaining. Two shots. Maxi Kleba ready to do this. Maxi Kleba didn't get the first one down. As Jazz are making some changes here, but Donovich just checked back on the court. Back on the court by Bogdanovich. Klebo will take his last last free throw after the first miss. He has to stay focused. The second free throw to Burrow Klebo is good. Just the first uh, first point of the night. Just the point bucket of the night after the foul was on Royce O'Neal. Conley shot. Went off, laid up for Rudy Gobert. That was a that was a saver, saving off offensive rebound for uh, Rudy Gobert. Seemed like he was never been here in the first half. To, to, uh, he was like he was on cold. But that time, that was a savior by uh, by Rudy Gobert as he went back in and saved it once and for all. Anyways, I'm summing all one of each players uh, out on the court. Penny Smith, Delon Wright, Boba Marjanovic, and then uh, and then I'll be uh, bringing back Borea. Borea and Jackson. I will do. All five sub players are subbing out, and all five five players are subbing in. But they're gonna have to find out, and let's find out. Let's pick a different way here. Before we continue, here's your Jordan player of the game. This one is out to Kristaps Porzingis. Porzingis. And in terms of his a lot of his determination for uh, for Porzingis, his his, uh, his shot ability might be carrying it off wide. But when he knows about playing his NBA career, he might be the only one that wants to that wants to uh, enjoy himself to bring it back from here. Berea back out here. Passes to Finney Smith. After the first, now he made only the first block that he was making. Finney Smith rolling over to Jackson. Jackson. Jackson passes to Marjanovic. And there's a first shot went off miss for Marjanovic. Unable to connect uh, Jackson's assist. Shot for O'Neal's no good. Under two minutes right now on the court. On the on the scoreboard, it's stolen by Rudy Gobert. No foul called on Utah. Mitchell trying to look himself around, trying to avoid the defender. Here's Mitchell. He ties it up. Ten points for Mitchell, behind twelve points for Porzingis, trailing by two points. I'm gonna need to get the motion in. If I need the camera to stop it. It's stolen by O'Neal. One on one. It's good for O'Neal as he tie is broken. Right pass to uh, JJ Barea. He shot. Tied up. Unbelievable. They're going back to back. After O'Neal, then it's Borea's turn. How incredible is Borea doing? He's doing all right, but I think Brunson might be a lot more better than uh, than Borea. He might need he might need a lot of more help. Mitchell against Wright. 
Where's a shot? And the shot counts it for two. Marjanovic with his first personal foul. How does Marjanovic not have anything going on? He went off wide. O'Neal's checked out. Ingles is checked back in. After one shot, they need to they need to find something else. Here's one shot for Mitchell. Shot's good for Rick Mitchell. Now they lead by three. Jackson outside, pass to Finney Smith. 47 seconds left in the fourth. Back to Jackson. Screen on Finney Smith. Six on the shot clock. Pass to Finney Smith. The shot, the foul's on Bogdanovich. His second personal foul and their second team foul. Now, Dorian Finney-Smith never got a chance to do one here. And both both coaches are having a hard time keeping it showing up on each on each players. They gotta keep it going. Not even one of one of each player trying to make a comeback. But only Dorian Finney-Smith wants to have his own shot. Finney Smith hits his first free throw. Marjanovic is checked out and coming back in is Porzingis. Donkic, Curry, and Porzingis are checked back in from Jackson. And then, uh, um, I forgot what else right here. But, but, uh, however, Finney Smith, one shot left. And he makes both free throws. Timeout called by Utah Jazz. They're up by one. They're up by one. Six seconds left in the fourth quarter. Right now, this is right now. Both teams only have one timeout. But who will get their last final timeout? There might be some more. Uh, there might be some more opportunity here for each team. So you don't want to miss this one out. Tim Hardaway Jr. is checked in for Dorian Finney-Smith, and now we're back to the starting five. 33 seconds left. Try to put the three for Ingles. 22 seconds left. Ingles trying to find somebody open. Five seconds to shoot. Conley. Oh, missed the three. And here is Donkic. He's ready to break it. Curry. Here's a shot. Yes! It goes in! Donkic! Stay silent. He wants to make everything going back in. And now the final timeout will be Utah Jazz. Now they put a back-to-back a -back win. Back-to-back -back scoring on each team. Jazz first, Dallas next. What do you need to know here? There's a lot more to get things done. Now let's we'll put it back on the man to man, and then uh, we did the two to three zone. Let's uh, let's just uh, let's just go one through series, maps, uh, Philly series. Let's get the average of each. I'm sorry, uh, crash the offensive board, and then. This is it, their last possession for Utah Jazz. Can they do it? The shot! And that's it, the game's over. As the Mavericks puts a close game on a series, just like in the regular season, as Denver Nuggets beat against the Jazz. But now, Dallas Mavericks takes 59-58. to With an unstoppable run of Kristaps Porzingis. Now let's send it over to David Aldridge on the sideline and a save back by Luke by Luka Doncic. Thank you, Kevin. KP, you guys did a great job contesting shots and disrupting their offense. What did you like best about the defensive effort tonight? I think from the beginning of the game, we just started off uh, aggressive. We were connected defensively, and uh, that's how we were able to stop them. You got it done winning Kevin for stops. Thanks a lot. Back to you, Kevin. KP, the, the ultimate Jordan player of the game, has reached up with 12 points. 
And with a close game, it was an exciting matchup in Game 2. But Game 3 will be Dallas Mavericks at back at home playing against the Utah Jazz. We'll see how it goes with a, between the Western and Eastern Conference matchup. And for that being said, we'd like to say thank you all guys for so much for watching. If you like guys like to see some more videos, don't forget, subscribe to my channel. And you can follow me on my social media that I recently post. And um, after that, that will be everything that I do. And with that, peace out, bitches, for as well as a NBA playoff dial. Good night to Utah. Bates.